The potential damage from this heist could be felt for years. Criminals steal 80 guns, mostly handguns, but also a mix of rifles and ammunition, and unleash them on the streets. Who knows where they'll end up? When you lose uh, uh, roughly 80 weapons that are going to be out in the hands of people that are probably not law-abiding citizens, and we need to get these weapons located as quickly as possible. The thief or thieves punched a hole in the wall of the women's bathroom. Once inside, they emptied out the display case. They loosened security light bulbs and mostly stayed out of camera range. It is on the edge of the camera arc, so they knew what they were doing. Steven Yuska is the co-owner of the range. He was the first to see the damage this morning. You could look at a lot of different opinions on a building, but I'd say, you know, it's an older building. It's concrete block, and most people would feel that would be... <coughs> Excuse me. That would be pretty secure. So, uh, like I said, it, it, this one I would attribute nothing more than the the, uh, the willpower of the thief. Thieves who now have 80 weapons and ammunition to go with them. It is significant. Anytime you lose that many firearms, um, it's significant uh, because we don't know where they're going to turn up at, how quickly they're going to turn up, or what they're going to be used for.